Hey everyone, and welcome to today's tutorial. In this video, I will show you step by step how to transfer from Binance to EOB Global. Now, without further ado, let's get right into it. The first thing you need to do is to go over to Binance and log in into your account. Once you're logged in, you need to go over to Wallet and click on Find and Spot. Because, as you can see, over on this page, you can deposit and withdraw cryptocurrencies. Once you're on your Find and Spot page, you need to go over to your spot balance. You then see all the cryptocurrencies you're holding, and you need to go over to the right cryptocurrency, so the currency you would like to transfer from Binance to Huobi Global, and for me, this will be USDT. You then need to go over to the action section, and click on the withdraw button. You'll then be sent over to the withdraw crypto page, where, as you can see, the coin you just clicked on has been selected. Now if it's not, make sure to click on the coin selector, and search for the currency, and then select it by clicking on it. Now the next thing you need to fill in is the withdrawal to, or the address. So to find your crypto address, you need to go over to the mobile, click on balances, and then click on exchange account. Once you're on this page, please go over to the deposit button in the top right, and then you want to go over to tokens, go over to please choose, or the search bar, and search for the currency you would like to deposit onto this exchange. You'll then see all the chains available for transfers, and you want to go over to Binance, click on network, and then view all the networks available for transferring. You'll then need to go over to Huobi Global and look for chains that are available on both Huobi and Binance. Now in this case you can see that the ARC20 and the TRC20 are both available on Binance. So I'll go ahead and select the TRC20. By the way, if you want to take a look at the fees, just look right here and you'll then see that if I was to use the Ethereum chain, I would have to pay $24 in fees. And if I use the TRC20 or the Tron chain, I only have to pay $1 in fees. Then you want to go over to Huobi, click on the chain you just selected on Binance, then click on send deposit address, click on confirm, and you can then go ahead and copy your address. Once you've done that, please go over to Binance and paste it in. Now you want to click on network once again, and you'll see that all the unmatched networks are automatically removed, and you want to click on TRC20 or whichever chain you would like to use. You can then go over to the withdrawal amount, and fill in the amount you would like to withdraw. You can also click on Max to select all of your available holdings. And if you would like to withdraw from your funding wallet, make sure to address that right here. Now the next thing you need to do is to click on Withdrawal, and you'll then see the withdrawal confirmation. So please be sure to double check all the information to make sure you haven't made any mistakes, and then click on Continue. You'll then see the security verification pop-up, where all you need to do is to click on Get Code, and fill in the two-factor authentication codes sent to your phone, your email, or maybe generated in the Google Authenticator. And once you've done that, just click on Submit. If you found this video helpful, let me know by leaving a like or subscribing to my channel for more tutorials about cryptocurrencies.